Let me show you a quick serger tip. What happens if you're serging and the stitch just doesn't look right? Well, put a different color in. And what I have here is here is a stitch that is exactly perfect. And notice all the different colors. Well, the colors with the looper and the needle line up with the serger. So we have the left needle, right needle, upper looper, and lower looper. Check out this piece here. I wrote on it so I could remember, but the upper looper is too tight. And look what happens. On this side, it doesn't look so bad, but if you notice, this color here folds over to the other side. It's not supposed to be that way. It's supposed to be to the end. What about this one? The upper looper's too loose. So notice how messy these stitches are, these red ones. Look at how bad they are in the back. They shouldn't even be back there. So as I look, I notice that the red stitches are the bad ones, so it's the upper looper. Here I have one sample. I messed with the far left needle. And look on the back side compared to this one. Whoa, where's that purple coming from? Something's wrong. So I look at the purple, I look at the dial, and don't forget you can change these around. So, oops, that was too low. Try another stitch. And I notice that on the number four, I don't see the purple anymore. It looks great. So put a different color in each one, serge samples, and remember whatever fabric you're using, if it's a woven, if it's a cotton, it changes. So you might have all your settings on the neutral, which is number four, but you might have to go up or down just a little bit to get that perfect stitch. If your fabric is curling or you have colors that are, especially if your loopers rolled to the wrong side like I showed you, that's really ugly and your outfit or your garment is gonna end up like a hot mess. So try this, I think you'll like it. See you next time for some more serging tips.